this is a little video to let you know um, about me. Um, basically, I am a person who has a heart for charity work, and uh, that's what I do with my free time, my spare time. Um, it's sort of what I was doing with all my time for the past four years, although I've loosened a little bit from it. I've changed to a lighter variant. However, generally, um, generally that's what I do with uh, the rest of my time when I'm not working. Uh, I run a campaign, Truth About Drugs, and um, I give out booklets to children at school and people who I think would benefit from knowing the truth about drugs and uh, basically I try to pass on the gift that I was given when I was a child. I got uh, one of these, uh, well a couple of these Truth About Drugs booklets. Um, would you mind handing me a booklet? <laughs> okay, amazing. Yay. Okay, great. I got like one of these booklets. Um, I think there's like a collection, I read the whole, like, this is a general one, but then I read the whole collection of the books, and um, as a result, I've never been drunk and I've never been high in my life. Um, yeah, and uh, honestly, I feel like, um, although life always, you're always trying to get somewhere in life, and uh, you don't necessarily appreciate all the time, um, that you're not stuck in these things. Uh, you know, sometimes I do understand that. I've dodged uh, some bullets where really other people cannot escape. They cannot escape just being stuck in, drinking alcohol, uh, smoking marijuana, all these things. It's actually ruined a lot of people. And um, the reason why I'm not in such a ruin is because I got one of these books. So usually, um, assuming I'm not thinking about too many other things, I'm going to be doing this. Uh, now, <laughs> I feel bad. Like, it didn't land properly. Anyway, <laughs> I feel like I'm disrespecting the book. I'm very respectful of this, like, organization I work with, drugfreeworld.org, and uh, they supply me with all the books that I need so that I can go and um, help people to know the truth about drugs. Uh, where do you come in, in all this? Basically, you are going to give me money. <laughs> uh, well, you are. Um, I use my photography to fuel my uh, adventures and uh, my ability to give um, of my time. It's the right type of job that it doesn't take my entire day and I can go ahead and help my fellow man which really is what God made me to do it's the most obvious thing ever and um, yeah uh, I just wanted to let you know what exactly you're paying for one you're paying for the photos that you want it's very hard for me to take a bad photo reason being I'm very well learned when it comes to photos um, taking photos I've studied 63 books so far. Um, one of them was a dictionary with the purpose of being able to study the knowledge of the greats even faster. Chances are, the best photographer you know, I can defeat with a pencil and a paper. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I mean, kind of. Um, maybe, maybe I'll need a camera. Maybe. But... Yeah, I, it's very hard for me to take a bad photo. Um, I'm eight times internationally published. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I'm ready to make the image that you want. Um, my control is perfect. Um, feel free to talk to me. I'm here for you. I'm here for you. <laughs>